<clears throat> here we go. Never say never again. A very important part of the franchise that, well, not really the franchise. has no part of it. Sean Connery went off and made his own movie. While it was okay, I wouldn't call it something that was great. It kind of stunk at the same time, but I thought it was kind of funny to watch it. Okay, so here's the Laserdisc version. As you can see, the front isn't a terrible cover, actually. And if you look in the back, it shows you all this other stuff. Wow, this it's, it's going to be on three laser discs. Yeah, because it's 134 minutes. I forgot it was that long of a movie. You can see all the different stuff. Okay, let's start off with disc inspection. Let's just take both of them out and go from there. Let's try... Um, let's... I always like to start with the first disc and go... And go and see what happens. Alright, this is number one. Let's take a look at this. Not much damage, a couple of scratches. No, nothing too severe. And you go to side two. Nothing. You know, I've been very impressed with all the um, laser discs I've been buying lately. You know, so they all used to come in with a huge amount of scratches and stuff. You just, if you pay attention, you'll see that they'll come in good if if you buy from the right seller and stuff. Okay. Here's the one with just one side. This is just the product side. Well, let's take a look at that. But sometimes it can be more scratched than any of the sides. There's a few scratches on there. Very difficult to see. Um, then you got side three. Little scratches. Not much. And that's it. So we found a, a 007 movie finally that is in actually some decent shape. Actually, it's not new. All of them were. And then you just this one I like though. This case is a little easier to put the laser discs in. It kind of just look at how because it needs two space for two. It's very easy to get them in. A lot of the other ones sometimes you have trouble. But um, that's just how it is. And they have these nice um these nice paper things to put them in. Not those lousy plastic things that crumple up. All right, that's it. And bye-bye.